Hi, my name is Epoch, and in this video, I want to show you how you can kind of speed up Loop Hero. Now, the footage that you're seeing right in front of you right now hasn't been edited in any way. This is the original running speed that I'm playing at. Now, what I've actually done is I have doubled the playtime that you can actually say. So when you look at the top, you can actually increase the speed from one to two, but I kind of went into the program files and I kind of changed the speed. Now it is completely safe, but it's still at your own risk. Now I have found some other people who have done this. I didn't really discover this myself, but I have read that there is one issue with doing this and that is the treasury. Now, when you are playing at this speed and you are unlocking the treasury by placing eight adjacent tiles to it, it won't give you all the resources that you would normally get. But that is the only downside and I don't use the treasury anyway, so I don't care. But anyway, I will just quickly show you how to do it. So first of all, you're gonna go into Steam. You're gonna go into the library. There you're gonna look in the left column for Loop Hero. When you found Loop Hero, you're gonna right click on it. You're gonna go to properties. And then you're gonna go to local files. Click on browse. And then here you can find all the program files of Loop Hero. You're gonna want to go look for the little file called variables.ini. It's the last one. Now, first of all, I just really recommend that you actually just make a copy of this. So you're gonna just copy the file and just leave it there, right there. And then we're gonna change the one with variables.ini, so not the copy. And there, when you open it with Notepad or something, then you're gonna go look for the line called game speed. So game underscore speed. Now right now it's at 60. Whichever you write here, that's gonna be the speed times one. So that's gonna be the baseline. So remember when I said in game that you could change from times one to times two? Well, this is basically that part. So 60 is the times one. So multiply by one, so that's still 60. Now we're gonna change that to 120, what would normally be the times two. So we're gonna change this to 120. That means when you're playing on the times two speed, you're gonna actually be playing at 240. And that is pretty fantastic. Now you're just gonna save this notepad and you're gonna boot up the game. Now, when you're playing in the bottom right corner, there will be something saying that the INI has been changed, but don't really bother too much with it. I have found that no Steam achievements have been locked due to this. I have been getting Steam achievements while playing this game at this speed. I can't call this cheating because we're not really changing the game in to get any kind of advantage over anyone else. So it's basically just gaining some time and just, you know, wanting to not use treasuries because that doesn't really work at this speed. Once you've really figured out the game, you will probably just want to do this just to save some time. There's a lot of farming in the game. So this kind of speeds it up quite drastically. And if you're a father like me with a full-time job, I really appreciate this trick. So that's me. But hey, let me know what you think in the comments down below. I want to thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.